Delays in municipal approvals for new homes in the GTA hinder housing supply growth, limit choice, and drive up costs for home buyers. The first step when building a new home is to get the necessary planning and building approvals from the city or town where the housing is going to be built. Under Ontario's Planning Act, municipalities are required by law to approve official plans, zoning amendments, and subdivision plans within three or four months. However, not a single municipality in the GTA meets these timelines. In fact, according to a 2024 benchmarking study, average approval times are 20 months and can stretch up to 34 months. This is 5 to 8.5 times greater than the legal requirement. And new housing often requires multiple approval types, further compounding these delays. This isn't the case elsewhere in Ontario and in Canada. In stark contrast, cities like Calgary can turn around approvals in just 5 months, and London in 10. Prospective new homeowners in the GTA bear the consequences, as these delays not only slow additional housing supply, which limits choice, but it also increases costs. Builders face mounting financing, administrative, and material costs during these delays, which can escalate expenses significantly. Each month of delay adds between $2,673 to $5,576 in added costs per unit per month depending on product type and location. Based on average approval timeframes, this adds between $43,000 and $90,000 to the cost of a new home. Again, based on housing type, size, and location. No wonder affording a home seems impossible. Governments must do something to make the dream of homeownership possible. Go to buildgta.ca slash do something and tell municipal governments to cut the red tape and make municipal approvals quicker.